Welcome back everyone to Wellstopia. During the interval between episodes, I built the first of the four towers so that I could figure out exactly how each one should go. I decided on a wall of five and a half blocks. The half block was so that I wouldn't have mobs spawning on top of my walls. And I made the towers eight and a half tall. And therefore this stand on top of the tower is at seven and a half. And then I have a little stairway down here so I could easily get down here. And maybe someday I'll get around to turning off auto jumps since that could get annoying at times. And then we have our little floor here. And going all through here. So what we want to do is to build our second wall. And I th actually, I think the best one for the second one is the one that is facing out here. Now, originally, my plan was to put the entrances to these on this side. But when I was building out there... Hmm no foundation. I didn't think about the lack of foundation that I had on these things. Uh, well, if I have extra stone later, then I'll worry about it then. Let's see, but I have this yeah, out at the second. So therefore, this is what we're going to do, and this is going to be our entryway. And then I'll have just have this moving up. One, two, three, one, two. Oops. That's not a good way to start. Good. And we'll just get our blocks all around here. And what I want to do is to build a little bit of a stairway. And the stairway then is going to lead all the way up there. This way I can get up to the wall easily. Before I build the stairway, I will get the rest of the tower section up. Of course, it starts to rain now. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I. The halves should not have gone that far, obviously. So let me take care of these. Good, and I could have those halves for other parts. So now we can get that in there. Ooh. Okay, just want to get rid of them. Make sure I don't lose those extraneous ones. Okay, there we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's... <sighs> Alright, and then it's just regular rain, so it's not a thunderstorm, so I won't have to worry too much about that. And then finally, we get the topmost. And there we run out. But fortunately, I've got extra stone here. Though I am getting near the end of my stone supply. So that's something for me to keep in consideration as I build this thing. Alright. And now I need to get a little bit of a stairway. Now, of course, I'm not going to be able to reach that high. I think that should take care of that. Now, I'm going to place a stairway here. I think that's what I want. Up here. Stairway here. Stairway there. Stairway here. Okay, and a stairway here. And right here I am putting a Hmm. 
What did I do wrong there? Of course, that's right. I start on the door side, not on the far side. Okay, we will try this take two. Can I reach there? I didn't think so. So therefore, we will try this again, and we will go here. Actually, since I went here, I'll just put in the filler afterwards, too. And then that would mean... No, not there. Don't want to go too... Alright, there. Okay, actually, this is a perfect place for me to do it that way. And that way I could put it down here. Good. And then I put the solid block here. Put this down here. And this down here. And I think that's what I want now. No. See, well, that'll be a tricky one to get. Well, I'll think on that as I sleep. I see what he did wrong. All right. Now it makes a lot more sense. I was supposed to put this here. Yes. That makes a lot more sense. That goes there. That goes there. Now it all makes a lot more sense. And, well, I don't know if there's any. Actually, let me see if I could. Get that in like that. No, all right. Mm. Well, I'm not going to worry about that then. I'll just stick those two there. Stick that there. Stick regular block there. Good, 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 good. And with that done, we can then take out the shovel and put in our little bit of Ooh, stone slabs. Oh, here they are. I thought I had some of them with me. All right, good. Two, three, and then, all right. That looks a lot better. So this is our second tower. Now that means over here uh, we could put in our birch landing, which I want to start with right here. And the idea for the landing is to put this right here so that the landing is spawn proof. And with the landing being spawn proof, then I won't have to worry about using torches all around here and stuff like that. But I'm also going to make this area spawn proof by placing this here. Now I am going to extend the birch out a little bit more. Alright, and that completes the second of the towers that we have. With two towers now down, it is time to go to the third, and actually that's a bit high, isn't it? Because we only want, let's see, we want to go one, two, three, alright, so this is supposed to be the height of the wall. Yeah, so we just want to extend this, or oh, actually, we want this to be extended like that. So that's what I'm going to do is just to fill this all in and then fill in the rest of that and I will have a third wall complete. It appears that while well, I got rid of the spawnable locations on the 
Lighthouse Island itself. There are a couple of nearby locations that are still spawnable, such as that little island there. And I'm a lousy shot. All right. I know that is not a surprise to anybody out there. But I guess that means I should put a little bit of a torch up here just as a warning to sailors. Say, yes, there's a little bit of a sandbar up here. <laughs> if I can get on top of it. All right. Okay. Okay. There we go. And now can I get on top? Up there. Up there. Good. All right. That's one less islet to worry about. So we do have... Okay. We won't do that other half yet. <laughs> ah, they're shooting us. They're shooting us. Ah, let's get on with our work. One of the disadvantages of having this out this way is that now the wall is high enough that I can no longer see the moonrise when it comes up to tell me when it's the best time to sleep. So, yeah, walls aren't perfect on that matter. Maybe I should move my bed up to the next level. I now have the rest of the towers all done, so that's complete. And I also have the dimple on this side so we're doing pretty well on the exterior we've got four walls we've got dimples on two sides of those walls we have four towers going all the way all the way around We have a ramp, and we have the lower section of the base of the lighthouse. Now, one thing that I don't have right now is a good supply of stone. So, therefore, I'm probably going to have to take a little break from this project, at least until I have time to do a great amount of quarrying. I'll check my inventory on the matter but once I do have that the question is what next and what would be next will of course be starting on the ramp and the ramp will be starting here because this is where the animal carts will be coming up and then we'll be continuing along clockwise all around here and I don't know how high it's going to go on each of the trips but maybe set it up so I'll need about two maybe three trips around then I'll be able to get to the upper part of the lower section we are going to be needing seven more stories we have three right now We'll be needing seven more in order to reach our top floor base where we're going to have our little observation platform where the tourists go to. And this, of course, will be the transition point where the ramp will have to transfer to the intersection where we have the circle. So whether you use ramp or whether there's some sort of pulley system to get the wood up, I wonder what they would have used. Would they used a smaller ramp on the inside? But that's obviously for later. For now, we're going to have six blocks per section. If we did seven times around, that would be the case probably because you'd want a relatively shallow ramp. So how about six times around and that we will go on each side here up three times. So essentially what I'll be doing is something like this and then up like this for three and then up like this. 
So essentially, we'll go three for there. Well, I'll get the exact numbers of what I'll be doing. But we'll be gradually going. The idea is that I'll go one step up for the first third of the room, then the next step for the second third, and then the next for the third third. And that's to represent a very gradual ramp, which I think will be consistent with what you would have had in the actual tower. It'll be a much more gradual one than this, because I think the real ramp going into it would have been a more gradual one than the one I built here. So yeah, I am going a little bit off the mark here. But I think on the interior, I will try to be closer to the rest. So I'll go three around, three around, three around, three around, and therefore, each time around will represent one story of it right because 3, 6, 9, 12 and 12 half steps then will be equal to one story that I'm doing here. So that is my plan. So when we return next time we will begin on the ramp and we'll work our way up one story at a time and if I don't have enough stone for doing the outer wall at least maybe I could at least have enough birch in order to do the ramp. But that's what we'll work on in our next episode of Piney Plays Minecraft Wellstopia.